Well, this silly brings back memories of getting on the boss. I've not done this since my teenager days, so this brings back a lot of memories. So I'm getting the boss into Preston. So I will see you guys in Preston. <laughs> What's going on, guys? Just GC Football here. As you can see, we're starting the day in Weather Springs. So it's Preston North End versus Watford. So at the minute, I'm on the Doom Ale. I say, I'd probably rate it 5 out of 10. It's nothing special yet. So we'll see how today goes. Hopefully, we'll see some goals third time in Baskin here. So Preston versus Watford. And I will see you guys in the next pub. So as you can see guys, we're in the Guild... What's this place called? Guild Ale. So this is the Guild Ale of the house. I'm on the... It's like a sour cider, I forgot the name. It's been took off now to run out of it. So 7% this. It's a very sour uh, cider, 7% this one. I said, that's Watkins, I'll get back to you the name of it, but it's, I probably rate it 5 out of 10, and that's been generous, but the more I drink it, the more I like it, it got so strong like that. So it's the Watkins Kingston Black, I'm on, 7%, like I said, 5 out of 10, but those you like, the stronger it gets, it's a really dry cider, very sour, Joe's Juicy would hate this, but I kind of like it, the more I drink it, not so I'd have again, I'd be on the spin in. So as you can see guys, we're now in the Moorbrook. I'm on the Bruton, so we'll see how this goes. So I'll like, give you my rating. <laughs> so now we're in the Moorbrook, we're on the Bruton. How does it taste? I think it's the best thing about today, that. I can't give it a solid 6 out of 10. I think it's solid, like I said, not quite a 7, but 6 out of 10. I think that's a nice way to end this. As I'll see you guys on my way to Deepdale. What's going on guys, just to see football here. Like I said, I've just seen the lineups now. So Preston is quite familiar what we had against Rotherham. So you've got woman in net, so it's Story, Lindsay and Hughes at centre backs. Out on the right, it is Potts. Out on the left, it is Brady. So the three centre, so the three in the midfield, like I said, maybe four, as we might be playing the diamond, which I think we are again. So you've got Whiteman, Johnson, Brown and Ledson. And then up front it is Parrott. Like I said, I think Brown will play behind the striker, so I think we'll try that formation again. But get this with Watford. They're not playing Ismail Assar and they're not playing Yao Pedro, so that's interesting. Like I said, I just have a feeling that we do them 2-1 today. They're not playing two big players, they're not on the bench, so I'm not too sure what's happening. Whether they're selling both for Ismail Assar and Yao Pedro. But I'm confident, like I said, this first time I've ever done three out of three home games at Deepdale. That is the first for me. So this, uh, I've just got a good feeling today. Like I said, my score prediction, guys, is a 2-1 Preston North End. Let's do this. I will see you guys at Deepdale. Let's go. So like I said, Preston North End sits seventh in the table. So one win, three draws. And Watford are third in the championship minute. So with two wins and two draws. Hopefully it'll be a good game. Like I said, a bit interesting about Watford star players, how Preston protests. Hopefully we'll play like Rotherham. If we play like we did against Rotherham and have a go at them, I don't, think, I don't think we'll go too far wrong. And eventually we will get that goal. Credit, I thought one fair bring us minimal amount. Like I said, it looks a bit over a thousand of them. We're fine, boys, here. Welcome to Dino. Like I said, we do one for two on today. The missing star, missing Pedro. I'm confident. Let's do this. Come on, Preston. Come on. Four minutes there. That's a great chance from Brad, but good time from Watford Kipper. Four minutes in here. So it's been a very frustrating game so far, like I said, really boring. Not a lot to tell you about, like I said, I've had a few shots and why one for now. But it's hard to see where the next goal's coming from, like I said, because they have been improving second half here. Really boring game. So 12 minutes in, not really a lot to tell you. Like I said, just a couple of times I've broke team, but not a lot going on here. Hopefully they're brightening up, hopefully they'll get a bit more attacking here. Like I said, I think we're playing a 3 4 one more, but drop behind the parrot. Uh, 20 minutes in, it comes pressing. Oh, oh. oh, 
like a good shot from Lesson could save. Two man set added on here, corner to Watford. So a half time call guys, like I said, there's not a lot to tell you about. Like I said, we've got half time from Preston and Watford, but it's not really going to go there deep yet at all. Like I said, you can see why we're not scored in our previous two games. But I just need to be a bit more creative, a bit more aggressive, and it'd be nice to see you reach of the come on for go back to 3 5 2. Because they were like creative, they just need to be a bit more attacking. And not really a lot to tell you about it, like I said, come on, Preston, and that's about it really, quite important as well. So hopefully second half will be an improvement here. All I want to see is a goal, that's all I want, a pioneer goal, just to see that net rattle. Oh now, like I said, that's better. Like I said, half decent chance could save that from the lot for keeper. Couldn't press them. But with all that, it all comes from a Watford breakaway from our own corner. Like, it really should be bad, it should be 1 0 up, like I said, but huge luck for North End that one. Finally got 3 5 2 8 Reese on the job, so. <laughs> 70 minutes in, another half decent chance for Watford, that. Alright, double substitution here, so Watford and McCann on, Ledson off, and Brown off. Another half decent chance. So Watford taking the game to North End now, we need to get a grip on this game. So just under 10 minutes here to go, nil nil. Can anyone find a winner here? So just over three minutes to go here, Clemson to Preston. Four minutes I did on their data, can we get a winner? So as you can see guys, we're at Preston bus station. Like I said, it brings back a lot of memories of not being in. It was such a very long time. It's been over a decade since I've done this. Like I said, just wait for the bus. But uh, to conclude the match really, I think Watford deserved the win, just about. And they really should have scored at least 1-0, like I said. Preston lacked creativity and we just didn't do much to Trifflers because they didn't do enough to deserve the win. And Watford were the better team, I mean, all honesty, without Pedro, without Sark, without Dennis. So, fair credit, like I said, it's the third nil-nil, like I said, one day I will see a goal at Deep Dale. I can't believe I've gone three games now without seeing a single goal, so three nil-nil. And it's just incredible, like I said, it's, I've never known this with North End. I've never known this for myself, three nil-nils on the bounce. Like I said, I've seen a score away from home, but... Because we've got to do some, I think we need another striker like that, like I said, just to give them competition. We need to be a bit more creative, a bit more aggressive and press more. Yes. As it really showed today, like lack of quality, I think Watford were the better team, like I said. So, third credit, like I said, it's another draw. We're still unbeaten, still not conceded after five games in the Championship. So, on to the next one, which is now Wolves in the Carabao Cup. So, we've got a bit of a free hit with that one. So, we've got a chance to rotate as well, like I said. I want to see Fernandez, hopefully, he'll be back. Like I said, I'm not seeing in the lineup, but since Huddersfield, like I said. So, not too sure how serious the injury is. Like I said, but hopefully, I just hold out hope that we'll see a goal soon on this channel, especially in detail. But don't forget to like and subscribe to Just GC Football for more football content, more PNA content, and hopefully, I will have a goal for you guys in detail. <laughs> but I've been Just GC Football.
peace. Ciao for now.